Hello, everybody. Yeah, uh, been a few days. You know, life gets in the way, and as you can tell, I have been busy. Yes, getting ready for 10. Uh, we don't have enough 10 to do all of this, but we do have copper. Now, let's explain about what some of this is. Okay, yes, the 10 is cooking. We have 10 cooking. The 810 that I figured up in the last about what we need with 10. What do we need with 10? What kind of tools? Well, we definitely need a pickaxe. Don't need a hammer yet. Definitely need a pickaxe. That's 100. That's 100. Okay, let's skip over those. We need a weapon, something better than our spears. And I'm going to make a flax. Or basically in this game, it's basically a sword. That's called, anyway, it's called a flex. Anyway, shovel. Do need a shovel. And a prospecting pick. All right, so that, this over here is 100. Well, fell in a hole. Um, pit hole. Anyway, this is 100. There's 100. That's 100. That's 400. Oh, but we got 800. Well, knife blades. We need knives, too. Yes, 10 knives. 10 knives. That's 200. And we need saws hand saw blades this is going to get us into planks this is going to be awesome we are literally getting into planks oh, 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 oh. what what do we got what do we got oh really i could have swore that would have been enough Crap. i gotta go get more coal i gotta go get more coal hurry 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 where is the coal Where's the coal? Where's the coal? Where's our coal? That is our coal right here. Three before it loses temp. Oh, it's ready. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay, it's ready. Uh, swap hands with this and pick this up and put it in the hands. Okay. Well, how about that? That was interesting. All right. Don't know how the tongs is helping us pick it up when it's in our bare hand anyway all right let's pour our tin pickaxe since it's over here let's pour our tin flax blade our tin shovel our tin prospecting pick gonna get into that now we've got 400 left for our 10 knives, this is going to be awesome, and this is going to be great. Oh, you're going to love what this happens, that what creates that. Okay, all right. I'm just going to stick that back, that crucible back in there since it's literally empty, and we don't have anything else in it. But now I'm going to go over here. I'm, I'm actually going to go in here. All right, how much, how much do I need? Okay, each one of these is 20. Yeah, so that's, I need 200. All right, I need 200 copper. 200 copper. Oh, not that one, this one. Uh, uh, where did I put all my copper? Did I use all my copper? Or is it in my inventory? Well, I have something in my inventory that I really don't want y'all to see. But anyway, I guess I'm going to show it to you. All right. I had some more. Yes, I used some creative tools to get some things because basically making all this stuff out of clay was just literally a very laborious task. And uh, making eight of these is, I mean, it, you can do it, uh, but I'm I'm in a tutorial. I, I'm not going to waste, I'm, I'm not going to take my time sitting there making eight of those uh, in a playthrough. Yes, I made eight of these by hand and then I literally hit killed them but I I mean making all these uh molds and stuff I just went to creative tools got them I did y'all did see me make these I did make those um but creative tools yeah like eh. all right these take 25 each that's that's really cheap now why did I make the strips mold nails and strip mold okay well guess what this is going to get us planks copper strips 
makes. Let's see. Copper. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I think I just saw it. I'm probably missing it. I just, I'm not, I'm not seeing it. I don't know why I'm not seeing it. I'm just not seeing it. Copper bits, copper ingot, copper plate. I'm just not seeing this. Okay. All right, let's go. N-A-I-L. There we go. Nails and strips. All right. Nails and strips. Look at all this stuff that you need nails and strips for. Okay. I mean, you can make all kinds of stuff. Now, this is a mod. Yes, the boat thing is a mod. Um, you can make a boat in this game, but it, yeah, we're not ready for the boat. We're not ready for the boat yet. All right. Yeah. Uh, all right. Here we go. Wooden chest. Look at there. We need boards of any kind. And nails and stripped of any kind. Now, yes, there's steel strips, but any, any kind of, any kind of nails and strips. But copper's the cheapest. See, copper is the cheapest. You can use any kind of wood plank, and wood literally creates. I mean, you know. And how do you get wood? How do you get that? Well, get a saw. And a plank or you, as you can see when it changes it shows you the handsaw this one all right this one this blade is the one we created not that blade that blade is created on an anvil and we don't have enough metal for anvils yet okay but we can chop down logs and we can now with that with it with it cooling we can create one of these now why don't we we don't have meteoric, meteoric iron just yet so, but you know that's beside the fact but you can see how much how much you get you know and this over here is showing how you can take something that's already been made into a block and use a saw and get the planks back out of it You're, it's basically recycling um, but by using this, it will produce a, a, an abundance of planks. Uh, so that's why I have the nails and strips out here is because we want chests. And they are going to be so much more glorious and better than these baskets. Now, I think it's the same number as what these hold, uh, but they're just, they're faster to make. Instead of like sitting there and slapping uh, clay together and then having to fire it, uh, you know, once you got these, let's see, 715 degrees, yeah, it's still cooling off, still cooling off, can't touch them yet. Can't get them out yet. It can't. It, it won't let you. It won't let you do anything. You can't. You can't even pour water on them and cool them off. So I mean, it's just. I keep falling in that hole. Gee whiz, that pit kiln is really. And I, and I know it, it's. This is temporary, and I mean. Once we get all this and everything, I am going to take time and get myself out of this area into a new area i've been thinking about it and having y'all go through the painstaking ability uh, uh, process of watching me move i might do a time lapse and just put it out there you know that moving day 
when I find a good area because you know oops uh this area of course that's where the wolves killed me it, this area is just there there's bear that spawns in this area and comes close there are wolves all out in here and I mean it's just I know there's sulfur here I know that there's other stuff here but I can come back and mine this stuff I don't have to live here you know move up into this area or move I might I might actually move down into this area down here because this area down in here was it was close to some borax and some copper was down in this area I think but I think I mined it out but I mean I've got why is that not showing me what it is hello what's going on There we go. Oh, basalt gravel. Oh, okay, that's just oh, some brown coal. What's down here? What is this? Obsidian stone. Uh, you know that. I mean, and that could pretty much get us some stone and stuff that we could be do more decorative stuff with the building. I'm not necessarily into the whole let's decorate things up and be pretty and nice and all that and eat moss oh, and there looks like an area that's see they have the difference in color here now I know I, I'm, I'm getting ahead of myself the next versions of this game literally remove all this colors and I'm I'm scratching my head trying to figure out why the developers want to literally turn this into a colorless map and take the colors out of this. Because finding the stuff in this game is literally going to require exploration. I think that may be the reason, but I mean, you can see discoloration on the map right now. Uh... uh I hope they put an option that we don't get rid of this because see there there's something here there's something right here that surface and some of these black spots and I can't find uh, some of these are just shadows but I don't know if I've got a spot that's marked terra preta but some places okay some places that you see or will find like this I think no no that's shadows still shadows like this this here is basalt gravel or something it, it's a darker gravel but this gives you an idea of what I'm talking about instead of it being that purplish gray color it'll be solid black and that's a very big sign that terra preta is right there and it's usually next to water a lot of time it's next to water sometimes it's out in this marshy area but terra preta we've we found it i've got a big box full or chest full of it but this is what i'm talking about i'm just saying i uh, i want to get away from the wolves i've just got to get away from the wolves you know building the house right here not going to be far enough away from the wolves or the bear because the bear was like right here and i killed the bear and then there was another one so two bears in the same area i mean yeah you can kill them they'll be gone for a little while but the game just basically they're going to respawn this is this is basically their spawning area and i just happen to be here so we got to get we got to get out of here waiting for them okay it's cold see how it I looked at it, it says it's cold. All right. And it says take work item. When when that pops up, even though it will see it's 300 degrees or something like that, it, now that it's cold, I don't have to have the um, thing in my hand. So I can get rid of a few things. Uh, let's put that in my inventory. Put that in my inventory. And, oh, you know what? Let's do this. Let's get rid of the coal. 
I don't need the coal in my inventory anymore. And I don't need the tongs. So let's get rid of the tongs. Let's clear out our inventory. Get this stuff out of here that doesn't belong. Don't need that. Uh, mm, no. Oh, where is it? Where is it? I guess I'll put it over here. Uh, I need to make some. I need to make a tool rack. Thing about this, I don't want to start. I want to keep make. I want to keep making stuff that I'm gonna have to literally move. So that'd just be more inventory. Okay. Uh, move that. Move that. Uh, move that shovel. Got some. Got plenty of sticks. Okay. Take it. All right. Over here. Take this. Take that. Take this. Take those. Take those. Ta-da. We have got a bunch of tools now that are ten. Oh man, so amazing, so amazing. And they're ten pickaxe, awesome. And look at that, nine hundred, nine hundred. That the durability on that's going to last so much longer. Just give me a second. I had to get up and shut my door anyway all right the durability on that pickaxe i mean compared to the copper one which was 600 we got an extra 300 durability and all we did was mix a little tin and copper together and we gained 300 durability and it's a tier three this is a tier two we can break higher level rocks in the game trust me this is a game changer the bronze bismuth bronze tin bronze black bronze whatever kind of bronze that you're capable of making once you hit this level uh you can break iron yes iron is capable of being mined with a tin pickaxe not a copper pickaxe you have to have tin to break iron that's the game changer all right all right weapon let's get rid of the spear we don't need the spear anymore look at that awesome spear okay yeah i, I was right I, I was talking about the uh, that's fear light that's nugget of copper we need Uh, need 40. It's 200. You don't have to do this. I, 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 you don't have to separate it. I just, I like doing that. Uh, and I am going to close that off and just wait because I'm not going to fire that right now. Uh, oh, that is Galena. Oh, that's sphere light. Oh, it's zinc. Okay. Yeah, I guess I put the wrong things in the wrong place. Yeah, that's for nuggets. Uh, just gonna have to move things around. Oh well. Okay. Put that there. Where'd my hammer go? Oh, it's in my hand. What the heck? Okay, now make a shovel. Where's my sticks? There's my sticks. Shovel. Prospecting pick. This is this is awesome too. Uh, let's make a knife. Now I'm not gonna make two knives. There's a reason. What the heck? Okay. I'm going to make a saw. And yes, I'm going to make another saw. I'm going to use I'm going to do that. That's it's definitely. Now. Uh come on, I make it already. Okay, maybe it's not that. Yeah. 
Yep, missed that. Okay. Bam, bam, bam. Damn. Oh, do that one, that, do that one. Do this. Take these. Put them in here. Uh, take the knife. Replace the, that knife. Take the pickaxe. Put the pickaxe there. Shovel. Uh, get rid of this shovel. Oh, yeah, well, okay. What else? Okay. I didn't make ha an axe head yet. We'll get there. I will get there, but this thing, this is, this is, this is the, this is what we need right here. Let's put that saw up there. Uh, we're not going to do anything with those. Do that, do that, do that. Now, I'll show you how to store these. It's getting dark. I'm going to use the spears anymore. If we do crouch and shift and control. Boom. Shift and control. Boom. Shift and control. Can't do that. Can't. Not there. Won't let you put it there because, good grief. Because of the flower. Take the flower away. Plant the flower somewhere else. Crouch and control. Shift and control. Prop up things on the... That's what you can do when you don't have... Let me get my torch out and put it in my hand. There we go. When you don't have the tool... That doesn't even light up anything. Why is it not lighting anything up? Okay, well... We're going to change that. And uh, I hope I have enough. I should have enough of those. Uh, let's see. What else is there? I need logs. Logs. This is the next thing I'm going to show. And then I'm going to say that kind of been going a little long. I know that I just jumped on here. We did a few things and then we jumped and I'm jumping back off. But, you know, time is something I don't have a lot of. So, don't want to make the game like super i don't want to make this episode super long where it, it there we go here we go uh let's make pine pine let's make pine planks okay and let's see do i have i mean i was literally in that box and didn't even see them okay all right we got a saw got a log you don't have to put them in the middle you can literally do this right here do the same thing Okay, four. Yes, I know if I had the other saw, I could make 12, but I don't have the other saw. This one is like basic. That's, I think it's one of the mod tools. I'm not sure. Mo yeah, Yabba Forge. That's it. The Yabba Forge uh, mod that says down there, uses. Create four planks per log, creates four sticks per plank. Yeah, I mean, this just gets you into planks early. Da, 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 da. Look at that, 28 planks. Oh, that is so awesome. All right, I'll stick them over here. And then I'm going to take this, and I'm going to make parchment can make 16 parchment that's awesome 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 and then i'm going to take a plank and i'm going to put it in there and then i'm going to take parchment and i'm going to do this and i'm going to do this bam and this is why i like the farmer this is why i like the farmer bam look at that Look at the light that this thing puts out. 
this thing has absolutely an immense amount of light. You stick it up on there, yes, it dims down just a little bit, but I want to show you something about this light. 21 in your hand. And water does not put this thing out. But you can't, for some reason, let's see here, we can't put it in our off hand, which is irritating. If I can hold it in one hand, I should be able to hold it in my other hand. Anyway, it, anyway. there we go. Now we're just going to make a bunch of torches and light them. And you can make them and put them in a fireplace and cook them up and everything and have a bunch of torches and have a bunch of these all over the place. And uh, you will, and yes, I know I used my only torch, but I will get another torch. I have a fire starter somewhere and I need to eat. And I'm going to say, uh, see you later while I eat. And that was probably all of that. It probably didn't raise me up much. Yeah, it didn't. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And eat again. And how much of a portion do we have left? Point one of a serving. It's not even a. It's not even one bite left. Okay. We're full. We're. We're looking good. Um, look at that. Started at 20. I told y'all. I told y'all that building your food up, getting into cooking is just paramount. And I mean, I started at 20. Sometimes I start at 25. Sometimes I start at 30. It's not even necessary. When you, get, when you can get into cooking so fast, just with rudimentary stuff that you find out in the world, you can build your health up you can start at the game settings as basic as 15 but i like to start a little higher 20 is good but look at that i mean my, my nutrition is looking great i don't have any dairy yet but eh, uh i don't think we need it look at that i mean my health points are so high already and that's how you increase your health points but anyway i was going to do the 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 uh, nails and strips and do the chest but i'll save that for some other time i will cook that up and i will get those melted and next one we'll make some chest we'll switch things around and maybe between now and then i'll do the time lapse where i move everything to the new location and uh you know have us a new home something that's a little bit better than this mud hut that we started in and uh, maybe I'll have a pit kiln area and all that set up the way I usually do and we don't have animals trying to kill us every time we go and the howlies yes the howlies but until then everybody be safe take care of each other and holy cow that's dark uh, wrong one Uh, I might need to take this inside. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Put that on the inside for now. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Now it's all nice and lit up in here. Isn't that so bright? I mean, that's just amazing. That adding parchment and four planks to a torch. And I've got paper lanterns. This is what makes the farmer just OP in my game. It's that right there. I love the farmer. Not only the effect of that, but you can harvest more stuff out scavenging for food. You can harvest more from animals that you kill. The farmer just has so many perks that people just ignore. And they, it, it's just a great, I mean, yes, it's a mod. It and everything, but I, I mean, whoever come up with that mod, it should be literally integrated in the game. The farmer is just, it, it's, it's, it fits so well.
it just does so anyway enough of my rambling i'm i'm just babbling on anyway oh yeah look at my eyeballs so anyway till next time i know i jumped in here we were this was real quick real fast uh and uh you know i didn't want to i don't want to make my uh, the, the videos too long so more more rambling on next time <laughs> yeah uh see ya have a good one until next time bye